brothers and sisters, the very loud and clear message is being given here in front of the Indian Embassy, where a turbaned person like us, but the Indian stooge, Navtej Sarna is the ambassador, and who has been given one year extension now until 2018. I want to remind Mr. Sarna here, he has written a book on Zafar Nama two, three years ago, and he knows that what is the spirit of Zafar Nama with the tyranny of the Mughal rulers, whatever was happening in Punjab, whatever happened to the families and Sikhs of Guru Gobind Singh Sahib, Guru Gobind Singh Sahib in Zafar Nama, the letter of victory wrote to Aurangzeb that you will be very happy that you have killed my four sons, you will be very happy that you have killed my thousands of Sikhs, you have destroyed my Ananto, but you have snuffed out few candles. The whole hot burning furnace of Khalsa is around me. I'll make Punjab so hot that your horses won't be able to gallop around the plains of Punjab. And Mr. Sarna, you should give the same message to your government, which you are representing here. Your government thought that in June 84, by attacking our sanctum, sanctorum, Darbar Sahib, the seat of our temporal power, Akal Takhat Sahib, and 37 Sikh historical shrines, by killing thousands of Sikhs on June 3rd, 1984, the martyrdom day of Guru Arjan Sahib, your Queen Indra Gandhi thought that she has taught Sikhs a lesson which they will never forget. But you and your government know that how that bitch was punished on October 31st, 1984. Your General Vadya, who was the army in chief in attacking that, how he was punished in Pune. And for the last 33 years, the tyranny of your government to whom you are representing here is continuing. And now, your this killing regime has spread its tentacle, tentacles towards the diaspora Sikhs. It's very clear that five million Sikh diaspora, which is now a power in itself, the country, the capital where we are having this protest today, more than 50 U.S. congressmen are part of the U.S. Congressional Sikh Caucus in our neighborhood in Canada, the leader of NDP, the third largest party in Canada, is Jagmeet Singh, who is a vocal supporter of right of self-determination, right of Khalistan. Today in Canadian Parliament, there are 17 Sikh members of Parliament. The Defence Minister of Canada is a Sikh, and you know the strength of UK Sikhs as well. That is why your dirty hands have extended now to the diaspora six. Jagtar Singh Jaggi, who was visiting Punjab, has been arrested on November 4th. For the last three weeks, he has been continuously tortured, as is told by his attorney, Jaspal Singh Mantpur. Even on the onset of the winter, the warm clothes which his family gave to him were taken back from him. The British High Commission in Delhi was not allowed to meet Jagtar Singh repeatedly after he went to request. And the day he met him in Bhaga Purana court, the visiting card he gave to him was taken immediately away from him by the Punjab police. And today, your chief minister in Punjab, Amrinder Singh, is threatening diaspora Sikhs he is ridiculing the British members of Parliament. More than 175 British members of Parliament have raised their voice against torture of Jatar Singh. Yesterday in the House of Commons, from the Scotland, the member of Scottish Nationalist Party, who is representing the home constituency of Jatar Singh in Glasgow, has raised his voice. And not only that, even... 
यूके's प्राइम मिनिस्टर थेरेसा मे यस्टरडे इन एन इंटरव्यू टू द बीबीसी हैज सेड दैट दे आर फीलिंग विद कंसर्न व्हाट इज हैपनिंग एंड दे विल टेक अप्रोप्रिएट एक्शन मिस्टर सरना रिमेंबर दैट लाइक यू डिस्गाइज्ड एज अ सिख ड्यूरिंग द मुगल रिजीम आल्सो देयर वर चंदूस सुचानंद गंगूस लखूस एंड जसूस but they couldn't stop the sikh pathway the sikh march to red fort delhi you must be remembering that at that time the mughals the afghans and then the britishers they thought that by hanging sikhs by chopping them by killing them by having price on their heads you'll kill or they will be able to kill the spirit of freedom in every sikh but you are forgotten your killing regime is making an error always remember a sikh is either a badshah or a baghi a sikh will always fight for his freedom either he will be on the throne or he is ready to he or she is ready to face any form of persecution but 5 million sikh diaspora is very clear that in punjab your killing regime by killing a whole generation of the sikhs between 1984 and 1995 and subjecting the next generation to the menace of drugs you think that you have silenced the voice in punjab but don't forget that what is the power of the diaspora sikhs as diaspora jewish community was instrumental in the creation of nation of israel today 5 million sikh diaspora with its strength with with its political clout with its voice and particularly our younger generation we are proud today that today the protest which is being organized here is by our youngsters from the metro area virginia maryland washington dc our college going school going university going our professional youngsters they know that ultimately until unless in our fatherland in the land of indian occupied punjab is not free we can't have free access to darbar sahib we can't have free access to our brothers and sisters and now your killing regime has come to a point that where a person like batar singh jaggi who went there for his final marriage ceremony was arrested is being tortured and your whole system which claims to be the largest democracy on this planet in fact is the largest nazi crazy in the beginning of 21st century <laughs> message is very clear La- almost 3 centuries ago the khalsa who was created on in 1699 with a very clear message sovereignty is our birthright and whatever are the norms of sikh faith the basic tenets of sikh faith are enshrined in the un charter of human rights in the geneva protocols in the international law right of self determination is the basic fundamental right of all the enslaved people in the last decades we have seen that how united nations which started with 50 countries as member states in 1948 today have 193 countries in the last decades we have seen that how east timor kosovo macedonia countries even have become free from the yoke of the enslaving countries we have seen that how the referendums have taken place in quebec twice in 1980 in 1995 in scotland just two years ago and now there is a movement that may be in catalonia that may be in kurdistan for referendum and sikh nation which enjoyed a free status as a free sovereign sarkare khalsa jio until 1849 which had the territory of 150000 plus square mile territory we are born free people in 1947 
we were the third party in the negotiation of transfer of power. We joined hands with your Indian Union on the assurances that no constitution in India will be accepted, which won't be acceptable to the six. We joined Indian Union on the assurances that six will be given a province in the north so that they may also be able to enjoy the glow of freedom. But to their dismay, they found in the Indian Constituent Assembly that they are refusing to recognize Sikhs as a separate religion. That is when two Sikh representatives in the Indian Constituent Assembly, they rose in the Assembly and said, this is betrayal of the Sikhs. This is betrayal of the promises made to the Sikhs. We reject this constitution. Fact of the matter is that de facto, we may be captured in Indian map, but de juris, we are not part of India as Sikh representatives refused to put their signatures on the draft of Indian constitution. We have never accepted India as our country after June 1984, it was a very clear message. And at Akal Tahat, a Sarbat Khalsa took place on January 26, 1986, which formed a Panthak committee to lead the Sikh nation, which declared on April 29, 1986, that now we as a separate nation, Khalistan, whose boundaries are between the river Jamna, and Pakistan border at Waga, we are an independent sovereign nation of Khalistan. In the last 33 years, lot of sacrifices have taken place in our land. Over 100,000 of our brothers and sisters have sacrificed their lives. And even today, in spite of tyranny of your state, Jatadar Jaktar Singh Havara, who is in shackles, in chains, in the hard jail, whenever he is brought out, he shouts, Khalistan Zindabad. This is the defiant spirit of the Khalsa, and the very message which is, which is being given from here is very clear, that 30 million Sikh nation is determined to get our freedom, we are independent, sovereign people by birth. Our father is Guru Gobind Singh Sahib, Mata Mata Sahib God, and we belong to Anantpur Sahib. The freedom is the basic impulse of every Sikh, and let with a clear, loud message. On one hand, while we, we are struggling for our independent, sovereign nation, but we won't let that diaspora Sikh should be arrested and harassed there, and the very clear message is free Jaktar Singh Jaggi right away, and let the other three youngsters as well, those who have been arrested along with him, or those who are being tortured, dozens of other youngsters have been picked up from their homes, even the grand, uh, grandmother of Jaktar Singh Jaggi is being harassed, she is the only old lady living in the ancestral home of their her landline connection has been cut. Stop all this kind of harassment. Your, these harassments won't be able to stop the march of Khalistan, the march of our freedom. Let my fellow brothers and sisters, we may raise a few slogans which should be very clear message to these stooges of Indian system. This Navtej Sarna, who is representing here Indian government, and in the morning when we started the protest, one Indian stooge or Ra official came here to take pictures. And I walked to him and I said, leave this place immediately. Otherwise, we will do what happened to your high commissioner in Melbourne, Australia. And he... And he left the place. Let me give a very clear message. India out of Palestine. India out of Palestine. India out of Palestine. Indian democracy. Indian democracy. Indian thugocracy. Indian thugocracy.
इंडियन नाजी करे सी इंडियन नाजी करे सी इंडियन हिपो करे सी इंडियन हिपो करे सी इंडिया आउट ऑफ इंडिया आउट ऑफ फ्री जगतार सिंह जागी नाव फ्री जगतार सिंह जागी फ्री जगतार सिंह जागी फ्री जगतार सिंह जागी अकाल तखत तो आई आवाज 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 वाहगुरु जी का खालसा वाहगुरु जी की फतेह